Hi, I'm Willie. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here. If you're a first time subscriber, I hope you're enjoying all the tips, tricks, and configuration tutorials for your technology that I uh, drop around the channel. If you're a returning subscriber or viewer, thank you for being here. I appreciate all of you and this is only possible because of you. So tonight I want to talk about the Synology notification system. And the reason I want to talk about that is because I've literally had this question the last uh, week, probably like six times. And so I thought, what a great video. So a lot of times you want to do notifications. You don't have, you know, you don't have an email account that you want to use. You don't want to sign up for an email account just to use for re a relay. You know, you don't want to spend the money for an extra mailbox. You don't want to link a Gmail, all those things. So let's hop over to, let's hop over to the Synology. And so here we are, we're in the Synology. We're going to go to control panel and we're going to go to notification. So this is where you set up your notifications, things that the, that the, I almost said router, but you can, if you've got the Synology router, you can do the same thing with the router, but this happens to be on our Synology NAS. So if we have, if we want to do emails directly from our own email provider, we would enable this here and then we would select either Gmail, Yahoo, Outlook, QQ or custom SMTP server, we would fill all of this information in and then use this configuration to send us messages about our Synology. So if you go over into advanced, this is going to show you all of the different items that you can be notified about. And then it also shows you as an email, SMS, mobile, because if you have the, the DS app, you can get push notifications to your app, but you can also um, send notifications using Synology's email server. Okay, so if you want to receive email messages about your NAS, your Synology NAS, and you don't want to use your email provider, you don't want to set up Gmail to do all that, all that stuff, you can come in here. So once again, we are in notification. I'm going to uncheck the email because we're not going to configure that. SMS, there are a couple providers. Click a tell and then send in blue. I have, we'll, Maybe we'll do a, uh, I'll sign up for one of those and we'll do this. I'm not as thrilled about the SMS. I'm sure it's got some really good practical use. But, uh, and I could, I could actually see it for... Um, you know what? I could. Well, you know what? I've got some ideas now that I say it out loud and we'll we'll deal with that. But the push the push service, what you can do is you can pair the push service with your app on your device and then push notifications directly to the app. Or you can do send notifications regarding system status, system status via Synology's email server and you can enter up to two accounts separated by a semicolon. So here I could put Willie at howx5.com. Now when I click apply, it's going to send me a verification email to my, to my email account that I put in here, my email address. And it'll tell you whether it's been verified or not. If you don't get the verification email, you come in here, you cleanse, click send verification email and then you just confirm the email the uh, or confirm or verify the the email account and then you're good to go so then the synology can then you know you can use synology's email service to do that so it's just another really great option for notification if you don't have your own you know email server um i i got that question a lot recently so i thought we'll just we'll just talk about it so um maybe once i make a few other changes we'll do the email configuration too i think if you're probably used to doing email relays that that's going to be really simple for you to do but i'll still do i'll still do a video on that but the push service if you don't want to use all that other stuff the per the push service 
may be perfect for you. So check it out, see if it fits your needs. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe, please comment and share. Please follow me on Twitter and Instagram. If you need IT consulting, please go to willyhow.com. Fill out that contact form and someone will contact you as soon as possible. If we can't help you out, we'll get you to a vendor who can. That's our promise to you. If you want to speak to us on Discord, the link is down below. If you want to support the channel by becoming a patron on Patreon, and thank you to those folks uh the link is down below if you want to buy any of the gear you see here on the channel there is an amazon affiliate link down below it doesn't change your price but it does kick a couple bucks to the channel to keep things rolling in once again i want to thank each and every one of you and as always i'll see you in the next video